For a time, it seemed, we would know peace. But it was not to be. For Diablo's essence lingers in the Black Soul Stone. I cannot destroy the stone, nor allow its evil to remain within the heavens. And so it must be hidden, even from the angels. I pray that it will be enough. Done well, Horadrum. Your service here is finished. And you should all. Okay. I I can start this actually. Screams draw me to the city of Westmarch, where angels slaughter helpless people in the streets. Who sent these reapers, and why? I will learn the answers, but first, I will end this massacre, and teach them to fear the Crusade. Yes. Fear the Crusade. The Nephilim. Sent me to find you. Malthiel has taken. People are dying in that city, lad. I won't abandon them. But you and Tyriel need to form a plan. We must find Malthiel. Tell Tyriel I will meet him in Westmarch. 
go. It will be done. I swear. Can I? Come back. I'm gonna try this. Because I can't raise the difficulty in game, but I want to. Wait, maybe I'll just wait until I get the wolf gate. Regard to die! Uh She's coming to kill us all! No! Damn it, the gates! Get inside this city and stop the killing. Though this Reaper wields a dangerous sword, it's sh shield with its rows of razor sharp spikes poses the greater threat. With a single thrust, it can open a man from waist to throat. That shield was not made for protection, it was made to cripple, maim, and kill. I watched in horror as the guard was struck by the Maiden's magic. I heard the sound of his screams until his flesh <coughs> dissolved in him, and only his armor-clad skeleton remained, his jaw unhinged. Blue mist swirled around his bones, coalescing into new flesh. When at last I cut him down, the phantasmal flesh exploded, leaving only a pile of armor. <laughs> during water. Nice crit, Cormac. To the streets. It's the end of the world. So many have been killed, and the Reapers are everywhere. Is anyone alive in there? General Torian was defending a group of refugees at the old Zakarum Cathedral, but they're likely all dead by now. Wait, you're the Crusader who saved Bastion's Keep. You'll save us too, won't you? I will. I swear it. I swear it. God. Demon blood. Those were innocent people. see with blackness. It gave way to a pale light that sapped my strength. It was amazing. But instead, I drew upon the last of my will and fought back. Color flooded back into my sight. The shadow was right before me, and I drove my spear through. As 
Malveil has imbued them with the ability to sense the living. Revenant archers do not rely on their vision to find their target. There is no place safe from their sightless gaze. They will find you through stone, wood, and even the ground itself. And once they have their quarry, they do not miss. Why are Malthael's <clears throat> armies attacking Westmarch? Because he feeds on death. Every time his reapers kill, he grows stronger. And with the prime evil gone, Malthael believes this is the perfect time to end the eternal conflict. Humanity has nothing to do with that war. But we are descended from demons and angels. When Malthael looks at us, he sees demons. The church! All the refugees are inside! Follow me! Oh boy, this guy looks cool, man. Akrat's Bane! This is worse than I feared! What is that? General... Torian? A death mate! Stop her! Your soul will be mine. <laughs> Another archer hit it flat as I charged, but this one stood its ground, staring down the arrow shaft on the lightless, empty eyes. Even as I swung my blade to take off its head, the thing loosed another shot. How can you fight an enemy that has no fear, nor thought for its own self-preservation? We must do everything in our power to slow the Nephilim down, so that the collection of souls is not interrupted. It is the key to Malthiel's victory. Let's end this madness. Where is Malthiel? I know only that he is not in Westmarch. He could have taken the Black Soul Stone anywhere in creation. But why does he want the stone? Is there any way to find out? There may be. A sliver broke off when Malthiel took the Soul Stone. Perhaps by studying that sliver, I can learn his plans. Then you study the sliver while I save this city from the Reapers. Yeah. I've heard of the Haradrim, but I thought they were long gone. Tyriel rebuilt the Order to help him take the Soul Stone from Heaven, and to protect mankind. After all, you can't be everywhere at once, no matter how powerful you are. I love the voice actor for Malthael, man. He's so cool. <laughs> Malthael, my brother. He was wisdom, leader of our council, first among angels, and now he has become this. How did it happen? After the destruction of the World Stone, Malthael's mood darkened, and he left the heavens frequently. Then he disappeared completely. He must have developed a connection, no, an obsession with human souls. 
Well, however he came to his madness, he's got to be put down. Death is meant to free our souls, not devour them. Yep. This sliver of the Black Soul Stone will reveal Malthael's plan to you? The sliver is still connected to the Soul Stone. As the stone changes, the sliver will change too. Therefore, I can observe what Malphail is doing to the stone, and if we're lucky, even discover his plan. General Torian, what was that Death Maiden doing in the Cathedral? She was creating an orb that turns the living into Malphail's death creatures. A single orb can transform hundreds of innocent people every hour, and my men report two more of them out in the city. Ooh. So, Crucibles, with two of them, Malphail has an endless supply of soldiers. Then I will destroy these crucibles and cut off Malthael's supply of troops. The soul crucibles turn the dead into reapers? Sadly, yes. The Death Maidens look like angels. Their story is as tragic as Malphael's. Once the vanguard of his wisdom angels, they followed him down the path to darkness. Yep. We stayed to fight, Robert and me. But it fell. And when they started to tear into him, I panicked. I ran. You did what you could. At long last, a hero comes to save us. That won't bring my wife back, though. Will it? You're right there. My library isn't far from here. I was closing everything up for the day when I heard the fighting in the streets. I barred the doors and then squeezed through the back window to escape. But I'll have to come up with something more exciting when I write my official account, won't I? West March originally grew from the efforts of the great General Rakis to spread his religion beyond the realms of the East. Seized by the superstitions of the Zakarum faith, he drove his paladins relentlessly across the barbaric western lands, subduing the uncivilized tribes he found there. Ultimately, he became king of them all. You've heard the legend of the tomb of Rakus, haven't you? Its location has never been found. Most scholars think it's underneath Westmarch, but I suspect it's somewhere outside. I smell a side quest. This was a clever man, after all. Hmm. Hmm. Lots of conversations to have. What's that noise? Is there anything on your mind, Hadrig? Do you think Cardium is under attack as well? Yes. At least they have the Iron Wolves. The Lord of Lies could not break them. And the Angel of Death will not either. I know who is responsible for this. It's the poor. They've summoned these monstrosities to take Westmarch for themselves. That's what you think, huh? I can't believe we're still alive. And it's oh, all hey, thanks too. to you. I thought we would die in that foul-smelling place. You ask who's to blame for this doom? Or West March, reveling in sin, worshipping petty idols. The Zakarum are gone, and the order of Malthael now rises. Praise Malthael. Okay, pal. He spares only the faithful. Donate to the order and prove your conviction. It is good to see you again. Unreal. Though it seems like we are only brought together hell in the worst yay, of hell circumstances. Yay. But I suppose if times were better, we would never have met. For a moment, I heard one of my sister's voices. They could not make out the words. Each day, I feel the weight of every crusader who has borne my name. So I think I understand your burden. My sisters are gone now. And I am the last memory of a world long since forgotten. You do not know why your sisters died. That is why they stay with you. I 
Now the world's under attack and people are dying everywhere. It must be time As for us to go on happens, another adventure, you know? right? <laughs> time to go on another I'm going on an adventure! That's the vibes I'm getting from him. <laughs> Did you grab the jewelry at least? Harold, those monsters were about to kill us. Well, I would rather be dead than poor. Wow. I remember you. You suck. What is that? Musty cellar? Hey, do you got anything to say? Cormac, you seem troubled. For too long have I lived with the knowledge that my order tortures its initiates and twists their minds. I need to know how high this evil reaches. If my whole order is corrupt, what does it mean to be a Templar? What am I? An honorable man who dedicated himself to a cause he believed righteous. But it wasn't, was it? The guilty will answer for their transgressions. I swear it. I, I love Templar's story so much. Please, I can't do this anymore. Hello, Bryson. What what's going on? Someone came for me. After all this time. A cranky blacksmith named Hadrig was complaining about the noise. Ah. Uh. Bloody miracle. Sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I owe you both. Come with me. It's safe. And we've still got a little food. Awesome. Does he got something to say? Where is he at? Also, probably gotta talk to this guy. Did you know there were once two moons? Lyria is the one that is no more. <laughs> I think it's time I told you the whole story of Sai and his master, the god of desire, Durgis. You mean you are ready to tell your version of the truth? Durge's jewel has appeared again, <clears throat> and the time for secrets is over. Then you're finally ready to tell me if you were a god? <laughs> I found him in the streets. He seemed in a day, so I brought him here with me, but he's hardly said anything. He's nobility of some sort, but I don't recognize the seal on his ring. The flames! The flames? Well, he was covered in soot. Perhaps he escaped from a fire. He never says more than a word or two at a time. Hmm. Don Craig is just death in horror. I guess he won't. I guess he's nowhere to be seen. And uh, Miriam isn't available to us because she's actually available in this act. You find her in this act, so she's not here right now. Whoops. What, what do you got to say about that? Remember that noise I heard? It was that lad you rescued. I'm Bryson. I came here to see your friend. Oh, here, yeah, he's right here. <laughs> and no, he won't go away. You saved his life. You're stuck with him now. He is. I'm going to repay Hadrig by helping him with his work. And I told you to stay away from my forge. I grew up over by the docks, not the good part of town. It does have something it's what to say. my parents could afford. They died when the plague swept through a few years ago. Within hours of each other, like they had to stay together. I used to hate them for leaving me, but now it's a relief they didn't have to see all this happen. Fair enough. I remember the story about this. He tries to become his apprentice. 
Uh, I forget how it progresses, but yeah. Why would the angels do this to us? What are you saying? This is obviously a demon's work. Okay, well, I am going to end it here for now. Uh, I'll be back after lunch. I'm going to take my lunch break. When I come back, I'm going to increase the difficulty as well, just to see how much that changes it. So we're going to go to... Uh... Torment 3, I think. We'll, do, we'll try out Torment 3. 